Hi, I'm going to do a walkthrough on how to use Andruller. We're going to start off at the GitHub page, as you see the address right here. We're going to click on code and download zip. Once downloaded, we're going to pull up and we're going to extract all. And then we're going to double click into the folder and then you should see the files that look like this. So we're going to type in CMD and we're going to pull up our command prompt. Now Angular does have some um, dependencies that you're going to have to make sure that you're paying attention to as in they require 3.6 through 3.10 for the Python version and then there may be some installs you have to do depending on your system. So I'm going to run a pip install angular-u. So I'm just going to copy that command and paste it. And it's going to take a minute to run. Now that it's done running, we're going to go over to see the GUI command that we're going to want to run. So it's going to be Python dash M handler. So we're going to copy that and we're going to paste it. Again, it may take a minute to run. Once it's done running, you're going to be presented with a program that looks like this. So we're going to select an output to start. I'm just going to select my desktop and then you have options. You can do extraction USB, parse folder, parse.tar, or parse AB. I'm going to select parse tar and then I'm going to click on tar file. I'm going to run a tar file here and then once you do that it's automatically going to start running. And you'll see that the CMD actually coincides with what is coming up on Angular as well. Now that it's finished, you're going to see finished here, and then you're going to be presented with an HTML. Then you're going to navigate to where you selected for your output. You're going to double click that, and then you're going to double click data, again data, and then you're going to be presented with folders. You can double click into these folders and keep double clicking until you come through the data. And here is your images, your videos, things like that. And again, we're just going to go back up. And again, we're going to be presented with folders again. And then you could just dive into the data through here. Thanks for watching the video.